Oh, uh, what's the unload? You? God, how did we live with these hotkeys, guys? How the hell did we live with these hotkeys? Oh my god! Why were there so many spider mines? What the fuck? That is some bullshit! RTS, where I played multiplayer, um, it would have been either Red Alert or Warcraft 2. Probably Red Alert, Command and Conquer Red Alert in like 1998 or something like that, sometime around around then. Um, yeah, yeah, and, and a couple games of Red Alert. I'll never forget the moment where I, I friggin' my friend was pushing across this bridge and he had like a billion heavy tanks. And I landed a nuke right on them, and I was like, oh, hands off the keyboard, I'm gonna kill your whole army! You know, in the red alert, you're all just bumping into each other, trying to get across this bridge. And then uh, it, it took off like 1 20th of the hit points of the tanks. And I was like, what the fuck? A nuke doesn't even kill siege tanks? I was so mad. Little kid pig was like, <laughs> Thank God for cold fusion. Place. Because Only if we see a Zerg. Yeah, I got your Zerg right here. Cracking up the cold. I was going to extend that joke, but I was interrupted. I do have a wonderful forehead. It's shiny. Oh, fuck! He is up top right! Shit! My timing! Oh, God, no! Oh, God, no! God, no! God, no! I'll tell you the story of Darth Zealot and Artanus, Artanus Baggins. Once upon a time, Artanus Baggins woke up. He was a young boy. He lived in the cupboards of his aunt and uncle. He received a letter delivered by Lagolas himself about a magical school of wizardry called Mount Doom. So he built an ark because the world would be flooded. That's what Lagolas told him. So he built an ark and he took like two of each animal on that ark. Then when the water came, he found a ring all of a sudden in his back pocket. He's like, huh, what does this ring do? And all of a sudden, we had the Nazgul roaming around as doves with olive branches in their beaks. Excellent. We have you on vision. Ready to roll the shot. Excellent. Ready to roll the shot. Oh no. So, I will tell you this. Turns out. I didn't even make a citadel. Oh my lord. How good are marines against this? Oh my god, it seems. Oh, you just. LOL? <laughs> oh my god, four armor? <laughs> Executor, we have a problem. 
Our warp matrix was damaged during transit. Because of the extensive damage, we will be unable to warp in stargates to this location. Hang on, guys. We don't have stargates. We can't make scouts. I need a moment. Okay, I'm good. Eleven. Oh, for the sub. Ready to roll out. That Goliath, no. Complete. Ready to roll out. All right. I don't think I should be engaging this, but we're doing it. Oh! Ah, oh God! Thank you, War Mammoth. Ah, oh, thank you. Hail to the Mad King. Love watching you on off. You always make me laugh. Oh, Keep thank you. Awesome. I do my best. From your biggest fan in Montana. Thanks, Eltux. In Montana, eh? I've always wondered who the, my biggest fan in Montana was. Good to finally meet you. Alright, let's just go ahead and unload everybody here. Uh, thank you, Jersey Nick. Uh, oh, yeah, we're going to talk. Here's King episode. It's going to be good. That's That was the reason I always said I wanted to hold off. Thanks, Shelbs, for VRs, because I've already done two. Brood War is so busy right now. I love it. Look, I thought the ladder system was going to kill the, the the lobby game. But uh, no, it's it's up there, man. Look at this. All these games. Dylan's a loser. Fuck you, Dylan. The mysteries for the world cast. Alex. Yeah, I saw. The caster. Yeah, I think he's casting as well as playing. So there you go. The next level meta, man. And That's he plays random, <laughs> right? I think. Uh, yeah, I think yeah. he does. I think he's GM random, right? I'm not sure about GM. I think maybe High Masters, but maybe... Well, he's in GM currently, mate. Look at that. Well, come on. Everybody's GM these days. Might have just been as Protoss, to be fair. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah, you can uh, see Pro Race, right? Yeah, just as Protoss. T. Drogo right. is in there as well as uh, second seed at the bottom of the bracket. It's and... pretty good. Average APM, 1,420, what? I'm a fucking machine. I'm a mech god. <laughs> I'm a motherfucking mech god. What? <laughs> that can't be right. I'm a mech god. Sing me a song. Wait, what What do you song? Okay, fine. I'll, I'll sing you my personal favorite song, A Spook Basilisk. <clears throat> I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. Live in plastic is fantastic. You can brush my... Okay, no. I don't know. Anyway, thank you so much for the $15 donation, I think is what that was. I appreciate it, dude. Thank you very much. Louder? You can... They basically stand still and they still shoot. It's kind of weird. Also, look at my triple penis dragoons here. They've got three decks, each of them. Look at them. Maybe even four, dudes. Crazy, right? They were ready to impregnate all of those Terran units. And you get just get out.
I don't know if it's four, actually. Maybe it could be four. But why TIE Fighters sound the way they do is because their pilots are basically, in order to fly the plane, they have to have uh, an elastic put around their testicles. And uh, so basically they spend the entire dogfight just going as they go through space. It's pretty, uh, you know, it's harsh, but uh, it gets the job done. You know what I'm saying? Order, orders. SCP good to go, sir. All crews report. Why didn't? Reporting for duty. Good day, Commander. Oh. All right, bring it on. It's beautiful. SCP good to go, sir. Affirmative. I can't build that. Yay. Orders, Captain. Yeah. Yes, sir. I'm so Reporting excited to have hope. I have hope again.